If you are in or nearing retirement, you are likely to have more money than ever before. How about that? And for that reason, it's important to avoid big losses to your life savings. Joining me right now is Chris Kuchurchik, the president of Independence Wealth Advisors. And uh, everyone wants to take off like a big airplane there with, with, all, with all the money you've saved and everything. But yeah. what happens at the balloon bust? You lose a bunch of money or, you know, even worse. You know, we, uh, when we do financial planning, we test scenarios. You know, really a financial plan... Everybody wants your financial plan to tell you about how to be successful. You make five, six, seven percent per year. You're safe the rest of your life. But there's those what if moments, right? What if the stock market crashes? What if taxes keep going up? What if inflation goes skyrocketing, which it is right now? What are those? How are those going to impact our retirement? So we try to see what the plan looks like. It's kind of like if you think of like if you're going on a trip and you use MapQuest, you, mm -hmm. you, know, you go on a website, right. and you type in your your destination, it gives you a print off. But as you're traveling, if you hit a, a bad traffic accident, a detour, that map quest that you printed off is not going to tell you. So you want to make sure that like, you have a GPS system for your travel. You want to have a GPS system for your retirement as well. And that's what a financial plan should do. Yeah, that's right. I, I've got one of those things in my car, and it tells me if there's police ahead yeah. or if there's construction. And it sort of guides me in the right direction. So that's right. what we're talking about. Absolutely. And speaking of police, it's, it's interesting you say that. Um, I was challenged by a friend of mine, Vince Vinecourt, who was a retired uh, Cleveland firefighter. And he said, you know, upon retirement, he didn't know which way to go, what to do, and all that. He said, man, I wish there was a course for information that we could learn. Yeah. You know, because that's what we were taught. We were taught to, to help people. So he challenged me. We put together a program, which is starting off just this month in December, where we are going to be doing an educational series for police, fire, and EMS to teach them what to do with their retirement. We call it to plop or not to plop. Oh, I like that. So I'll have to get a badge and sneak into this one. It's going to be a great class. It's uh, free for the uh, for uh, police, firemen, and EMS. Um, also included, there's two different course styles. There's a one-hour course and a three-hour course. Uh, anybody that participates also gets their taxes done, which is a good time yeah. to start planning for taxes now. At Gotta the end do of the year. it. But if you go to www.iwadirect.com, you can see the classes that are coming up. We're teaching them at various local uh, libraries. So it's going to be a great opportunity for uh, the people that help us to be helped as well. Yeah, is finance a lot like physics, like what goes up must come down and things repeat, or how do you deal yeah, with that? You know what, they always say, you know, historic doesn't mean that the future is going to be that way, but there is some value to saying what's happened in the past could happen in the future. You know, we don't necessarily know, have a crystal ball of what's going to happen, but at the end of the day, we still need to plan for the what-ifs in life. And yeah, the market could be great, it could be bad, it could be volatile. I mean, heck, going into 2020, we had the issue with, with COVID, and yeah. the first three months of 2020, the market sank almost 40%. So yeah, we do need to plan for those things, and what do we do if those scenarios come, come, up, come in, uh, into our face? Yeah, you know, you, you know, you hear about neighbor talk, or guys, you'd be a guy in a bar, and people talking about what you should do, what you shouldn't do, and you really need a professional to you know, do the crystal ball thing for yeah. you. Well, I think it's not just a professional. You have to have someone that's going to take your best interests and put them before their own. Oh. You know, I see these guys on TV that, that that's, you know, sell annuities and stuff like that. They're selling those for commission. And it's very important that you have an understanding with your advisor that you're the boss. You're the CEO of your financial business. They work for you. So with any employer, they want to know how much their employee makes. That's a fair question. Talk yeah. to your advisor and say, are you working for my best interest and how much are you going to make on this <laughs> transaction? Because if they're making more money than you are in the transaction, that could be a problem. Doesn't make good sense. No, correct. Hey, so we're, we're December, we, you know, it's going to be January 1st in a minute. How about tax planning? Very tax important. Tax planning, end of the year, you've got to focus on We've only got a couple weeks left, so we want to focus on a few different things. Number one, can we do a Roth conversion by the end of the year? Does that make sense? Are we Because we're taxes are going to go up. Does it make sense now to do the Roth conversion? Secondly, even more important, is your RMDs, your required minimum distributions. Have you taken those? Because if you don't take your RMDs, you are going to have a 50% penalty on the money you don't take out. That's a huge penalty. So you want to avoid that. Make sure you look at your RMDs. Also, can you contribute to any kind of uh, uh, HSA, FSA, uh, 401k? You can max it out. Gifting. You're Gifting might be a great idea, absolutely. Yep. You know, especially one thing you want to think about too is if you're gifting, let's say you gift to a church or something, you may not want to gift cash. You may want to gift highly appreciated stock. Therefore, if you gift them highly appreciated stock, the tax ramifications of the sale of that stock, the appreciation, goes to the charity. And guess what? They don't pay taxes. <laughs> so you get good. a double tax benefit. You get the write-off, plus you get to save on the, the tax uh, taxability of the uh, investment. If you like that investment, just buy it with the cash you would have given and donated beforehand. Really good stuff. Really good stuff. So for you folks at home, if you want to learn more about protecting and growing your retirement wealth, good idea, right? 
Chris has a great offer for you right now for the first five callers with a portfolio of $250,000 or greater. He's offering a complimentary full-blown retirement plan just for you. And this will allow Chris and his team to sit down with you personally and provide you with a roadmap, analyzing where you are right now and discuss your best steps to really get ready for a successful retirement, a game plan to get you where you need to be. And that number to call is 216 400 5404. Again, it's 216 400 5404. And thanks a lot, Chris. Thanks, David. I appreciate it.